All right, we are in Massachusetts and we're gonna see what we can get for $5,000. As you can see, we only have two red dots. That's because I set the search criteria for 4,000 square, 4, square feet and above. And um, yeah, so we have two and I kind of scanned over them. So this one is 12 bed, four bath, looks like a multifamily, not gonna click on it. And then here we have a 10 bed, five bath and it's not the 1860? Wow, I think this is actually the oldest home we've looked at. But that's normal for the for the eastern side of the USA. I mean, that's where, I don't know my history, but the, they first came over to that side of the United States of America. So, um, yeah, 1860. Wow. Uh, not a huge amount of square footage. I'm surprised we only had two. If you do a lot of my other videos where I set that criteria, um, you'll see. Oh, wow. Sorry. But yeah, you'll see a lot more properties up. So, but yeah, this thing is old. A lot of history here. A lot of history here. And the renovations look to be about 90s, 2000s. I don't know. So, yeah. Uh, we're not going to go through all these. It's just, you know. It's actually very interesting that it's 1860s, but oh, wow. Yep. Yep. So is that, is that actual rock? So they just built into the rock, I think. Look at the brick though. Wow. And I mean, those beams, those beams are from, yeah, 1860. That's crazy. That is crazy. The copper, uh, water piping. I kind of want to keep going. I'm sorry. This is dirt. This is dirt built on dirt. I think it's gotta be dirt. Wow. <laughs> uh, cool. All right, sorry. I didn't think I was gonna go through that whole house, but um, all right, let's set the search criteria to no minimum and let's get looking. I just like to do that in the beginning because a lot of times you'll see some pretty cool houses with like 7,000 square feet for $500,000. So we're gonna start in Boston um and it's pretty cool but anyways let's uh let's scroll through here so we could start off with a condo this one i would like a condo with a water view i don't think we can get one for two units here whoa what's the square footage on that so two units okay uh 741 so this is the one we're looking at okay i mean it's quite a bit of square footage Definitely looks smaller there. So this is a two, oh wow, two bed. 1890, that is crazy. Okay, I want, okay, I've, oh, no, we don't want to sign it. I've never done this, but I want to see if I can set the, the year built. No way, okay. Let's see if we can find anything older. You guys skip ahead a couple minutes if you don't want to see this, but I really want to see. It's just in the whole area too. You're kidding me. Okay. This is insane. Let's do 1820. Apply. Okay. We're going to do 1800. The maximum year built 1800 in Massachusetts. Did anything, okay, I need to make sure I'm getting this right. Oh, is this all land? Well, that's a house. S Stop. I'm saving this, how do I save this? Okay, I ha I'm recording, so I'll just look up the address later. 1701. Now, we'll get back on track after this, but I mean, that's just unreal. This house was built in 1701. I'm like doing the math in my head. That's over 300 years old. That is crazy. Wow. And you can tell too. Wow. That's insane. Shut to do. 
This was built in 1701. Wait, 17... 1701, yeah. Get the fuck out of here. Serious. Where? Is that, is that, where is We're it? We're in uh, Massachusetts right now. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. I was doing... I saw one in 1850, and then I was like, all right, let me set the search criteria. And so I did 1800, and then I was like, what? They're still home? So I don't even know what I'm going to do. You should get a short landmark, dude. It's insane. <laughs> 1700. But I think it's just all going to be the land. Or, you know what? <laughs> There's no way. 1701. 1690. Okay. Okay, 1690, but then make it so it's... Where is it? Zillow and start looking at land. That's why I need to take off land. Oh yeah, nothing. Okay. That, that, I think that was the oldest one. Jesus. That's crazy. I wonder if like how much of a house has to be original to be still be considered that year, you know what I mean? How much what? Well the house has to be like has to be original to be considered. Yeah, that year. yeah. There there is a rule with that. I can't think of it off the top of my head. Um Cause I'm like, hey, do I really want a foundation? <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, as long as you keep the foundation, you can just update. It. But no, I was looking at that house, and it was, uh, it looked like it was from the 1700s. I know. Yeah, it's crazy. So. Everything's like 500,000. Well, I, I I have the search criteria set 495 to 505. Yeah. So. Well, I have to do the math on that. Like. Oh, this looks old. Eight, 1986. I imagine as a realtor, it makes sense to stay in that price range if you're charging 5%. Um, Fair commission. Yeah. We're only at 6. Not for us. Yeah. I was just Wait. looking out earlier. <laughs> <laughs> uh, land and property, man. Land and Right, Springfield. All right, so that's just land. All right, cool. This will be the last one we do, and then I gotta move on. Um, request, request a tour tomorrow, 1965. Oh, this one looks nice. Wow, very updated. That's so weird. It's like a wall, and then it's just another room. Interesting. Cool. All right. Well, <laughs> I don't even know if I can title this video $500,000 in Massachusetts because it's pretty much just looking at the oldest homes in Massachusetts. We found one for $1,700. Cool. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time.